What's going on YouTube, Brad Vapes here, back for another e liquid review. And before I start this one, I am going to mention that I'm in a different location than usual. Um, for the summer holidays, I'm back home with my family, so uh, just uh, excuse that. And in 13 weeks' time, I will be uh, back in my flat. But um, today, we're going to be reviewing a drip drop vapor e liquid. And this e liquid is called Chocolate and Raspberry Brownie. And it is 3 milligrams in nicotine. And I think you can get these in 3, 6, uh, 12. 18 and I think it stops at 18, but if I'm wrong, I'll have an annotation on the screen now um, These do usually come in a 60 VG 40 PG mix, but uh, mine have been mixed at 80 VG and 20 PG So it's a lot higher in VG just because it's a lot smoother and that's just normally how I prefer my liquids And these are 30 ml bottles, but these are some of my favorite 30 ml bottles because it's them um, Really long ones that are really easy, you know, just fit in your pocket and they're really easy to just take out and about and they're just nice to hold and they're easy to drip with and they're just really nice to use um, they're nice and squidgy but not too squidgy um, the childproof caps work really well uh, they're not too easy to get off but they're easy enough to get off that you're not going to struggle and yeah, um, only problem is the labels but they have been updated now so I'm not even going to touch up on that but yes, yeah, so this is a orange, uh, orange chocolate and raspberry brownie um, I'm vaping a 0 0.2 ohm dual macro coil uh, 4.2 volts which is 80 watts and yeah so uh, we'll give it a vape and we'll talk about the flavour and I'll show you the vapor production so uh, these coils are a little bit uh, well they just need reworking because I wicked them quite a while ago stopped using it and then just carried on dripping after a little while so the, uh, the wicks got a little bit uh, a little bit funny I don't know if you guys get that but if you leave it too long the wicks can go a little bit they make the vapor, but the vapor just seems a bit like not so dense. But it still tastes the same, and I can honestly say it doesn't really taste like a brownie. I am getting a fruitiness, but I couldn't if you didn't tell me the flavor, I would not guess that this was chocolate uh, and raspberry, a chocolate brownie with raspberry in it. Um, now I know that it's a raspberry though. I kind of my brain thinks yeah, that's a raspberry, but it's not because of the flavor. Because I have, as I've said, the flavour, it's a fruity flavour, it's like a kind of a berry flavour, but it's not particularly raspberry. Um, and the chocolate, normally with chocolate e-liquids, like I've tried, um, I think it was a Rip Trippers liquid, which had chocolate in it and it was just horrible. I've tried one, I think it was called Fat Bastard or something like that, and that was just a really sort of, for me, with chocolates, it tastes like sick, right? And Hershey's chocolate, I mentioned it in my vaping vlog with Matt, um, Hershey's chocolate has an acid in it, which... Uh, a lot of people think it tastes like sick because that acid is an acid which is regularly found in sick. And that's what chocolate vapes normally taste like to me, but this does not taste like sick, which is a good thing. But it doesn't really taste like a chocolate brownie. Um, as I said, it's got a, it's, it's, it's a sweet flavour. It's sort of a sweet, maybe a little bit biscuity, maybe a bit cakey, but not a chocolatey flavour. Um, and it's, it doesn't taste like a raspberry in particular, it just tastes like a sweet, sort of dark, cakey flavour with a berry in there and chocolate raspberry brownie is a no but a cakey berry flavour is a yes but um, obviously uh, vaping and taste and everything like that is subjective so if you are going to try this just keep an open mind because to you you might vape it and be like what are you talk about brad this tastes exactly like a chocolate raspberry brownie but to me I'm personally not getting a chocolatey raspberry brownie sort of flavour And I'm just going to have another drip and have another vape. And then uh, we'll conclude this. But um, yeah, £5 a bottle. I mean, I absolutely loved oh, the banana banana ice cream. That's one that I really enjoy. But yeah, smooth vape. As you can see, plenty of vape production. The rooms get a little bit foggy. I'm trying not to vape it too intensely because... Uh, my parents don't mind me vaping in the house. But they just don't like it, sorry, when they walk in the room and it's a, a smoke screen. So, uh, sorry about that cut there. Um, the camera just cut out for some reason. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. Leave a like if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys later.